All right, Merry Christmas, everybody. Um, it's been a good business day, and I figured I'd make this video um, about mods and stuff like that. Um, so today, I'm going to be showing you a puzzle I made, and it's a modification of a YJ Crazy Flicky Cube. Um, so it's half truncated, and um, it's really it's, it's a pretty sick puzzle. Um, it turns as well as can be expected. Uh, a crazy foot cube, you know, it's nice and smooth. It's not extremely good corner cutting. So, um, basically what I did is I took a Dremel, cut down the sides, and then I took um, sheets of plastic, glued them on to the shaved off places, smoothed it down. Um, so, here, I'll show you a piece. This is what a piece ends up looking like. It's pretty nice. Um, so then what I did is I took sheets of Oracle 651, which is the type of vinyl that um, CubeSmith uses to sticker, um, to make their stickers. So it's basically CubeSmith vinyl. Um, and then I hand cut it and you know applied all the stickers. And the colors are the normal color scheme on the, you know, the remainder of the normal faces and then on the new faces that are created <laughs> fuchsia which is like hot pink dark gray purple and light blue so overall it's a really nice puzzle um, it took me quite a bit of time to make um, it's not going to be in everybody's budget but I'm asking fifty dollars for it and I'll make a page um, where you can buy this cube and other mods that I've made so um, I'm going to be making more mods if these end up being popular, but I'm happy with the way this one turns out. It's really beastly. So yeah, I'll just I'll show you some turning quick before we go. Put it in the checkerboard. And of course, since I'm turning it 180 degrees, it remains in the same shape, but if you turn it 90 degrees, you know, the shape gets all changed up. So this is the giant half truncated cube made out of YJ Crazy Foot Cube from E3CubeStore.com. See you guys.